Hey folks, welcome back to another Train Sim World 3 video. This is the I just cleaned their scenario here on Northeast Corridor, Boston to Providence. Uh, so we're here in the cella, and let's get some lights on here. We have to turn the cab activate button on. Usually don't do cold starts like this. Now, I, I'll be honest with you, I haven't been playing a lot of Train Sim World or TSW, if you like, uh, as of late. So, I am going to be a little bit rusty. And, hold on, let me turn up, I gotta turn up the uh, game volume a little bit. Should be good there. Hopefully. Hopefully should be good okay uh, set the reverser to forward okay done automatic brake to release excellent now apply power to get moving uh, let's check out this stuff make sure it all looks good parking brake release uh, sand brake valve bell headlights are on let's make sure we got the marker lights on back here very good. Uh, I believe we're in Boston right now. We've got to be, right? Yeah, Boston. Okay. Um, Alright, I guess we're good to go. Set the cruise control first to so 10 miles per hour. And it looks like we're already moving. That's kind of weird. Okay. That's fine. Turn the bell on. I don't think I've ever seen it at night here. That looks really nice, actually. Alright. Um, so, yeah. It's been a while. It, it's It's been about four months since my last video. Um, and I apologize for that. And I'm also, in the same breath, I'll say I'm very grateful for the support that you guys have given me. Um, just, it's nice to see, you know, because I wasn't really even paying attention to the channel, I'll be honest. I checked on it every once and then, but it's just cool to see comments and stuff still coming in, even though I've been gone for so long. So I'm really grateful for the support, and I hope that I can be a slightly better uh, manager of this great place. All right, so we're going around my if my understanding is correct, we're going along around the route uh route. Oh my gosh, I'm so tired. It's like 11 o'clock at night. I should not be doing this right now. It's going to be a bad video. I'm just kidding. We're going to do the best we can. Um we're going around the loop. So it's going to be kind of slow. Turn the bell off. It's kind of slow. A little bit boring. I'm um, getting flashbacks from the sunny side up scenario with the ACS 64, but you know, thus the brakes. And it looks like I need to turn up my audio a tiny bit more. I'm so sorry. It's, it's it's been a long time, guys. I'm very very rusty. So I hope all of you have been doing okay. I know. I mean, the channel is is like so new. It, it's not. I don't even know if you could call it a community, but. There are some folks that seem to come back time and time again, and I'm, I really am very grateful for that. Up to 15 now. Uh, I'm not sure if we're going to have to stop here. It just says go via location, so we should be able to get moving, but I think we're gonna, probably going to have to slow down, if I had to guess. And once we finally get moving, so if we take a look here at the um, schedule, going to have to switch sides. That's going to be a whole lot of fun, isn't it? And then uh, Boston Back Bay, and we're going all the way to Providence. Yeah, so this is going to take a hot minute, but we're in the cellar, so once we get moving, nothing is going to be able to stop us. All right, are we, are we decreasing? What are we going down to? All right. So, I have to focus here. We're probably going to come to a complete stop. Yeah, so, 
penalty break, yada, yada, yada. We're good. We're good. I'm not sure. I should be. I should be able to acknowledge that. Um, but I can't. So essentially what happens with that is you have to put it into suppression. And then um, you just have to acknowledge it and it should go away. I don't know why it's not going away. That is very frustrating. Um, here, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna shut it off and uh, turn it back on. I knew this was gonna happen. You're definitely not supposed to do that, but hey, it, it works, right? Okay. Forward, uh, what is it, five miles per hour. Alright. All good. Life goes on. Cab looks so cool from the outside. Oh, yeah. Um, don't think I'm going to be able to turn the ceiling light off. No, that's the timetable. It's got, it's got a really weird bug, which, like, I hate with a passion. You have to, like, switch camera views and, and, and all that. So it might just be on for a while. It'll turn off at some point, as it always does, but I don't know. It's just a trick. So, yeah, very exciting. We're going five miles per hour around this huge loop, and it's going to take an eternity. But then the good news is we get to go up to full speed after Back Bay and go all the way to Providence. It's kind of funny. Um, well, I mean, the the updates for uh, New York to Trenton aren't... I don't know how close they are to coming out. I was uh, listening to some of the roadmap stream today, and it actually kind of made me lose hope a little bit. Because I thought they were sooner rather than later, but it sounds like it's going to be a while, at least another month until they're released... Which is frustrating because I thought that was going to be out sooner. But hey, whatever. I just want them to do a good job. You know, all I want is is a good good product that I paid the $40 for back in February. Um, so we'll, we'll see what happens with that. But I was uh, hopped on that last night and I had some crazy issues. Same old story. Not much has changed with that since release. So, I will, I mean, depending on how this channel, like, does, okay, we're coming up on the washer here, does meaning, like, how much time I have to, like, pump out content and stuff, um, I'll try and make a video sometime around when the update comes out, but I, I, I'm not going to make any promises there. Alright, here's the washer. Might be able to get a nice screeny here, we'll see. All right, go via location. Doesn't look like we have to stop. Oh, that alerter is crazy annoying. Oh, that's cool. That's really neat. Oh, that sounds nice, too. You can hear the rollers. Happy late 4th of July, by the way, to all my American friends. I think this channel is mostly uh, composed of an American audience just because, like, most of the content I do on here for Train Sim World is American content. So, that's just a personal guess, but... Alright, great. The train is clean. Now it's normal operations from here to Providence. Now, that's kind of misleading because I don't consider it normal operations until we get to about 
here because we're going to be going five miles per hour the whole time and it's going to be absolutely miserable and i might cut it out but i might not i don't know we'll, we'll have to see and the cab light's not going to turn off but it's all good we're chilling defro can you that'd be cool if you could defrost so annoying oh there we go it works proved me wrong once again now the trick is to not buy accidentally turn it on because for some reason my finger is always hovering around the L key I'm gonna take a sip of my beverage here I love the model of this thing. It's it's uh, it's a nice train to look at for sure. It's kind of strange. It's very like unique, you know. But they did a very nice job modeling it. The sounds, however, I'm not sold on the sounds. If we listen to the horn, then here's the low one. I like the low one better, to be honest with you. The bell is very good. I think they did a nice job on the bell, and it's really cool how it synchronizes with the lights. But the horn, to me, just sounds very, very artificial. Um, and, and maybe, I mean, to me, it doesn't sound like it does in real life. Um, but, I mean, it's in the ballpark, but very art artificial, in my opinion. Not that that's very meaningful to anyone around here, but but maybe maybe someone at Dovetails tuning in somewhere out there in the distance, uh, and and that that would be that I'd be honored. By the way, I'd be absolutely honored. I don't know how people become like you know the ambassador stuff, like. I mean, I'm I'm good at kind of just saying stuff is like going well if it's not. I mean, not on this channel. I complain all the time. Half of the video is just me complaining about something, even if it's not related to the actual route or whatever. Uh, like like just now, I was talking about uh, New York to Trenton, and we're on Boston to Providence. But so I, I probably wouldn't be very good at keeping my opinions to myself there. But like, I don't know if you're getting everything for free. I. You know, money talks. It really does. So, I don't know. But would I ever do it? I mean, not that this is just a completely arrogant thing to say, and they'd never approach me for it because I only have 42 subscribers, I think, the last time I checked. Um, would I say yes? I don't know. That's kind of, like, for me personally, anything like that, like an ambassador of, like, any sort of a brand. Um and I don't mean this like if I was Tom Brady doing like commercials and stuff. I just mean this like for me personally as like a a content creator. Oh, I hate that word. I, I almost hate content creator as much as I hate influencer. That's a story for another day. Um, it, it's like a morality question. Like, am I going to lie to all of you? Or maybe not lie. Maybe I could just say everything's okay and that'll be good enough, but... You know, I, I don't know. That That's kind of the scary thing with like those deals and stuff. You don't really know what's going on behind the scenes. I'd love to know. But like there's there's so many like ambassadors to Dovetail and they're just kind of like, I, I, I can't stand them. They, they drive me absolutely crazy because what I found out in the last year, the, in this past year since Train Sim World 3 was announced back in August, I've been heavily following this game a lot a lot uh less so in the past four months but uh i was i was like pretty alert to like everything going on okay it looks like we have some snow or maybe rain so we're gonna have to turn the wipers on here in just a second um i was really paying attention to what was going on 
And what I've realized is this company, Dovetail Games, and the Train Sim World franchise is just kind of like this never ending loop of like. I don't want to say broken promises, but that's the first word that comes to my mind, so I'm going to say it. But it just. It just feels like we're, we're trapped here. It's like Hotel California. We can't leave. If you know what I mean. Hopefully some of you can relate to that. Alright, let's get some wiper action going. Where, If I can remember where it's located. Um, that is the brake valve. That is not what we want. Tilting. We don't want tilting. We don't want the timetable. Is it over here? Wiper. Ah. There we go. That is very quick for low. I'm not complaining. Anyway, so would I say yes? It depends. I don't know. Oh yeah, that that's the other thing that's happened since I was gone. Um... I'm going to sound really silly here after I was just saying like how heavily I followed this stuff. Uh, Dovetail got acquired by the uh, that uh, French company. I don't remember what they're called because my memory is not that, uh, not that large. But they did get acquired. And all I know is I got a free DLC out of it. So that's great. But at the same time, I feel like they were kind of just really doing the bare minimum there because they, they had a free DLC for a week and it's oh wow that looks really bad and it's just like come on why don't you just put it in the damn base game like just do it we don't get anything for free right like we had that for a week the uh, I don't even know the name of the route to be honest with you the French Mediterranean something. I, I think Mediterranean's in French. I don't know how to pronounce that. Um, like, like we had that for a week. Okay. And then for the Glossop line, which is what, like 20 bucks? If you own Birmingham Cross City, because it's practically, it's practically going to feel exactly the same. You have a 10% discount, which in that case is like, I don't know. I want to say like $3 or something. So it's it's just like, come on, man. They're they're <laughs> they're doing the bare minimum as always, um, but you know that's just the way things roll around here. It seems like, but I don't know. Maybe oh yay twenty five. Maybe things will improve with the acquisition. Probably not because that was like a while ago, and I doubt anything is going to change. But you can always have your hopes up. This alerter is driving me absolutely mad. All right, so actually we're going to stick at 15. All right, chill out. We're going to stick at 15 because I think we're just going to have to go back down to 15 anyway. And that is snow. I don't know what month it is, but that is in fact snow. Let's get a closer uh, view of some of the cars. I like it. I like it a lot at night. I've never really taken a look at them like this before. It's cool. Different perspective. Okay. Uh, we're going to go down to 10. It's a little bit early, but we just got to do it. Soon there's going to be a bunch of people on here for their commute. Early work day. It's got to be freezing too. I'm, I'm getting like PTSD from winter. Just like thinking about that. As it is a beautiful 
July day here. It's like almost 90 degrees today. It was absolutely beautiful. Dare I say this is my favorite American route? I, I think it is. I mean, it doesn't have much to compete with, to be totally honest with you. Because um, I don't love freight. And Trenton is a complete and utter disaster right now. So, this is this is my favorite American route. Oh, we're headed back to uh, Boston South. Didn't know that. Feels kind of goofy because we just went, we were just there, and then we went in the wash, and now we have to come back. It would make more sense if we, like, started in, like, the depot. And then we um, we just took it from the like the shed or whatever and threw it through the wash. And then we came over here, right? Because this just seems very strange to me. Oh, I... This is something I realized um, while I was playing this a few days ago. The ACS 64, it's such a sleek train. It's got, like... This appeal to me that is just unmatched and, and, and dare I say it is a sexy train. Just just like it is so sleek and I love the Amfleet cab cars. And it's crazy to think I was actually in one of those quite recently. They were pretty nice. Uh obviously you can't recline the seat or anything though, so I mean it's hard to sit in them for long periods of time. But the bathrooms were very nice. It was a nice journey. I enjoyed myself. All right. Uh, about 400 feet here. The signal might go crazy. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to turn that off. Uh, and we're just going to throw a minimum break on there. Because Asus acts... Yeah, see, we're getting a penalty break already. Um, all right. So... Open the doors. I know we're really far off where we're supposed to be. Oh, it doesn't want us to do that yet. Alright. That's off. Um, this is going to be an issue. Oh, no. The marker lights are on. They just come on. Smart train. Smart train. Alright. Should probably do the low horn because I don't want to blow anyone's eardrums out. That's off. We should be move. Oh, throttle. I thought I turned the throttle on. I am very slow tonight. I apologize. Oh, I love the bell. The bell is so good. Those are probably terrible screenshots. I okay, and this is a personal thing. I I don't understand why back bay is a thing. It just doesn't make any sense to me. I'm sure there's some reason for it that's like really smart, and makes a ton of sense. I might have to look that up because it's just so nonsensical to me that we stop there and then we go like a mile down the track at ridiculously slow speeds and then we stop. Only once more, and then we go all the way to Providence. Okay, uh, let's turn these guys on again. Low. There we go. Can we turn the heat on just to make it? Can we hear it? Let's see. I don't hear anything. It's probably cold in here, so got to turn it on to make it more realistic, you know? So it looks like the worst is over. We should be, I mean, I don't know how, it looks like we're running somewhat on time. We should be in Providence at about 7.33. That's about 30 minutes away. Um, so that that's not terrible. Not too bad. Could be worse. Should be a nice journey once we finally get moving here. And these random 
flumes of snow are really ticking me off, but I'm not going to pay attention to that because that is not that important compared to the other stuff going on here. Okay. Very quiet. Not a lot of activity this morning. Seems like they were the only ones out. Hopefully we get to see the sunrise, but 7.33, it's a little steep for the sunrise, so I don't know. All right, put it up to 15. Excellent. All the way up to 30. Now we're moving. Moving just in time to slow down again. Because we have to stop at back bay. Woohoo! Absolute nonsense. I have to turn the cab light off again. Oh boy, this is going to be fun. Oh, there we go. See, it's working now. It's trying to make me look bad. Alright, do a low horn here. There's no, like, reverb at all, which kind of bothers me. Okay, uh, let's do minimum here. I'll be honest, I am not the best with braking on this thing because it's a little bit different than most trains. Like, I sh overshot something. Like, t Oh, boy, I just pressed the emergency stop. See, that's what I'm saying. I don't know how I did that, but apparently I did. Oh, look at that. It's got the snow all up underneath. It looks kind of fake, but, you know, it's the thought that counts. It doesn't look terrible. But it does kind of look like it's just painted on there because it was. All right, that's going to set us back a few points. That's for sure. All right, now we have to turn the... Oh, shoot, it was off. Dang it. All right, what are we at? Uh, 20. That's not bad. All right, turn the bell on. Let's please just shut off. Okay. It's making me It's making me sound like a liar. It's working. That might just be on Trenton. Well, actually, no. I, I did this last night, and it was a problem. Okay, maybe not. All right, turn the bell off. Um, yeah, so I'm, this is probably not the most interesting thing ever. I'm just kind of rambling on and I apologize for that. I am very out of, uh, out, uh, what's the word here? What's the word I'm looking for at 11 PM at night out of, uh, practice with my commentary skills. Uh, however, what I will say is the, um, knitter Telbon video that we did almost four months ago now I hated that I hated how that turned out that is my least favorite video on this channel and I almost didn't release it but I just decided to like it was supposed to come out a lot earlier than it did I had everything filmed like a day after the release but editing just took forever for some reason and like writing the script and stuff and it did sound very scripted. It sounded fake as hell. Uh, which is not what I want. At all. So I was very unhappy with how that video turned out, unfortunately. And that is by far the longest amount of time I've spent on a single video. And it was also the shortest video on the channel. So a lot of firsts for that, but it was kind of a disaster. However, what I said stands true. Uh, so that's good. Okay, going up to 60 now. 
I think, well, no, I'm going to bite my tongue, so I'm not going to say that. Pretty smooth frames are all right. That's good. All right, going all the way up to 120 now. We have 9.6 miles until route 128. It's a good amount of time. Just kind of kick back and relax and hit the alerter. All right, let's sound the horn so they know we're coming. The two people on the platform at 7.05 a.m. We're not going to make it to Route 128 at 7.10, so we're going to be a bit late there. But that's all right. That's all right. A lot of people there, actually. All right. Shut the bell off. Love all these tunnels. It's my favorite part of the route. Not not going this way necessarily, but coming back from Providence. It's very cool driving through here. Just because, like, it's the nice transition from uh, suburb to urban. And, and, I mean, it's nicer when you can actually see out the window, too. But, you know, got to get these scenarios done. Got to get them done. We're almost done. I think I have, like, one more left on here I have to do. Something like that. Hopefully the audio is okay. Because if I spend an hour filming this. And then like the audio is terrible. I'm going to kick myself. We'll see though. I, I think it's okay. I'm, I'm looking at the um, OBS here. And it, it seems fine. So I, I'm going to stay faithful with that. Let me know in the comments. What you guys prefer or whatever. I mean. I know pretty well if, if the audio is junk because I am very picky. Um, but you guys have different preferences than I do, so just let me know. It's like anything else in life. I should probably get a new microphone, but I don't think I'm going to because this is the first video I've made in four months. So, you know, it's not like I have a ton of, like, funding for this thing or anything. Not, I hate to say it, but I'm not super committed to this influencer lifestyle. Oh my god. Don't even get me started on influencers. It's a terrible word. I don't know who came up with that. It's like they started using it during COVID and a lot of bad stuff started during COVID that has nothing to do with COVID. Oh look, a uh, MBTA F40 right there. Great to see it out on the rails. Beautiful morning as this Amtrak Acela bellows through the random flumes of smoke that seem to appear out of nowhere. The flakes look nice, though. The, the, the snowflakes are nice, but I don't know whose idea it was to add the random plumes of smoke that looks very, very, very artificial. <laughs> but it's all right. It's all right. I won't harp any further on that. I've only said that five times. Coming along smoothly here. Uh, hopefully I don't un overshoot this like a like a, a newbie here. So I'm going to try my best to sort of manage the speed, but things could go wrong quickly. Uh, and I think we have bad luck today because we've already had some Somehow I hit the emergency brake. Like, that never happens. The button, not even on the handle. The button. So, just, we'll see. Not going to hold my breath here for anything. Oh, boy. That was, that was a bad camera tilt there. It's kind of annoying having to use the controller and the keyboard at the same time because I got a 60% keyboard so like it doesn't have like the uh, the arrows on there so I have no choice but to use the controller for the camera I don't use it for the rest of the controls but just the camera okay um, we should probably start considering slowing down I'm at least gonna put it on minimum here all right uh... Okay, that's good. Uh, just shut that off for now. 
See, this is what gets you. When it changes into feet, it seems very far away, but it's not. All right, we're going to go into suppression because that can't hurt, and we're probably going to need to. Uh, see, I just hit the emergency stop again. How did I hit the emergency stop? What am I doing? What am I doing? Oh, my gosh. We, this is this is going to drive me absolutely mad. We'll see. Okay. Here we are at Route 128. Track 1, of course. You already know. Track 1. Okay. Doors are open. Uh, let's see. What? Just for, just for giggles. Let's see which button on my keyboard does the emergency break. Is it E? No, it's not E. R? No. Q? No. A? Nope. No, I know what all those buttons do. I don't know why I'm hitting them. Is it Alt? It's not the Alt. It's not, definitely not the Windows button. Not Control. It's not 1. So I have no idea what I'm hitting. Alright. Uh, lock the doors already. Jeez, that was fast. I have no idea what I'm hitting to do that. So just hope I'm praying it doesn't happen again. Uh, so annoying. It is what it is. Okay, uh, forward. Why are we going backwards? Oh, we went too far on the cruise. All right, great. Uh, forward. What are we waiting for? Why are we... Why, why are our brakes on here? Oh, because it's in suppression. That's why the brakes are on. Look at that. It isn't the consequences of my own actions. All right, let's get moving here. Uh, absolutely beautiful morning. I don't think we're going to see the sunrise because the sky is still black as uh, night could possibly be. But we'll see. Maybe we'll get a little bit of a cotton candy sky, as they say it dovetail. Cotton candy sky. Gotta love it. It's what every screenshot for DLC is in now. It's the cotton candy sky. They don't show normal lighting because who wants to see that? Boo-hoo. Who wants to see all the problems with the train and what it actually looks like, you know? But hey, oh, I'm getting, I'm getting, I'm getting grumpy. It's past my bedtime. All right, 125. Here we come. Non-stop to Providence. I love the buttons here. These, um, I, for some reason, I feel like they're really squishy and like nice to press. Press, like they just they just look fun to hit, you know. Anyway, that, that's besides the point. And they're red, which is cool. I feel like I'm in like a spaceship. Should be there in about 15 minutes, so that would actually be amazing if that's possible. And then I think that, yeah, that's all we have to do. We don't have to go all the way back to Boston and go into the uh, washer again. So, some of these scenarios are just so silly, like I wouldn't be surprised. But speaking of silly scenarios, you can play as a guard on Glossop Line. Woohoo! Sounds like fun. Let's go check it out. And I'm not, I'm not mashing you if you're into that stuff, but I, I don't know. It just seems very, very, very unexciting to me. But hey, it can't be any worse going around that loop we did for the first half of the video. So, you know, it's it, different strokes for different folks. I should really just shut this alerter off. It's driving me crazy. Wow, we're really getting some bumpy track here. Yeah, see, the, the horn just sounds very weird. I 
That could be a good screenshot, actually. Oh, no, 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 no. Are we slowing down? No, we're not. Okay. Back to 130, thankfully. I wish they let you do, like, freight runs on this route. Oh, well. See, because I remember them saying that they couldn't do that because of, like, the safety systems and stuff. Because they're not integrated into the, um... Oh, I don't, I don't even remember the name. The SD... Was it SD40? GP38? One, one of the two. Something like that. It's not integrated into them, so it wouldn't really work. But, like, at the same time, I mean, do you really need that? Like, I don't know. I don't know how necessary it is. I mean, it would help, of course, but... At the end of the day, like, there's so much stuff in this game that is completely unrealistic. Like, that would not hurt, okay? It would just make things, like, more exciting. Nice to see that ACS-64. Oh, is that another one? It is. Things, things are busy down here in Providence. I guess we're not there yet, but we're getting closer to it. I feel like I'm in the cab right now because my studio down here, it's freezing. So it's like it's like I'm I'm in the game, you know. Zuckerberg would be so proud with his uh that's what it's got to be like in the metaverse, you know, with all the immersion. All he talks about is immersion. Immersion this, immersion that. I'm like so well, no, I shouldn't say that, but at times I have been tempted to purchase one what, what is it called? The Meta Quest. Just, just to try it out, you know, just see, see, and just kind of like be like, oh wow, this really does suck. Um, but you know, it's it's crazy because those servers are such a wasteland. It's kind of creepy. Like, I've always found like liminal spaces and stuff to be fascinating. So I don't know. Maybe that's another reason why I should purchase it. But I don't really want to support uh, that 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 whole venture there. But. Uh, you know, on the topic of Zuckerberg, if Zuckerberg... Oh, shoot. What's going on? All right. Everyone calm down. We're going to be okay. It's going to be A-OK. -okay. Um, okay, so... Wait, 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 wait. No, 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 no. We went, we went way too far. And why is the... Ca oh, I was hitting L. All right. My bad. Decreased the brake way too much. And the cab light's on now, so let's try and turn that off. Uh, where is that? Again, cab light off, off, off. See, now it's not working. It's not working. I'm not crazy. I am not crazy. All right, guys, I am so sorry I just did that. Hopefully no one out there is, like, motion sick. Well, if you're motion sick, you're not going to be playing a game called Train Sim World 3. So I shouldn't worry about it, but if anyone out there is should call me out in the comments and, and uh, tell me I'm a motion sickness phobe or something for my lack of motion sickness awareness. Um, but I, I apologize for that. Oh my gosh. Could it be 150? No way. That is insane. Wow, we're really, uh, we're really cruising here. Ah, oh, the horn, man. So unsatisfying. Wait, what? How'd the light, the light just shut off by itself? I didn't hit L. That is, that is crazy. How did that even happen? They, they, they just, like, mess up with the weirdest stuff in this game. They, they... <laughs> They find the most random bugs. We should totally do a Nidder Telbon video. 
uh, too. That would actually be dope because I, I really enjoy that route. There's, it's so special. So that would be cool. I should totally do that. For some reason, it reminds me of Halloween. So maybe on Halloween, we'll... Uh, why did I say hollow? 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 It's like almost sounded like it was like a British tone without the accent. Anyway, um, it reminds me of Halloween when it's raining and like dark. So that that would be kind of cool if we could do that around there. Maybe if if we have a video, maybe that'll be the next video after this one because that's like four months from now, right? So possible. It's a possibility. So watch out. Mark my words. Remember I said that. The Halloween video is going to be on Knitter Talban, okay? Four months from now. That's going to be the next video, guys. Hopefully, there's one before then, but I don't know. All right, 14 miles away here. We're making good time, I think. I don't know. Should be fine. And if we're not, no one's keeping score. Is anyone even on the train? Let's see, wait. Oh yeah, it's full. Okay, never mind. We are keeping score, folks. We gotta book it. Can we go to up to two hundred, please? I wouldn't be able to be a train driver. I'd just fall asleep at the at the helm. Like, with all the white noise is crazy. I mean, if the alerter didn't exist, that's why the alerter's a thing, I guess, so you don't fall asleep. But I, I would totally fall asleep, especially at night. I mean, I'd have to have a ton of caffeine to stay awake. All right, uh, let's keep an eye on that. So we're going to go down to 110 because that's going to take forever. So we're going to start that journey now, and we're probably going to have to put it into suppression. Um, the br I can't explain it now for a few reasons. I'm so tired, and I don't even know how it works that good. But the braking systems on this train are so cool. Like how all the like systems work together as a team. I, I think it's really neat. Um, but yeah, I am not a specifics guy when it comes to this stuff at all, because I'm, I'm not worried about like you guys doing it, but I know there's people out there, but, um, and no, actually you're wrong. This is how it works. Like, shut up, dude. I'm just trying to enjoy my life, you know? Anyway, um, oh, jeez. Okay. We're good. We're good. Oh, I don't even need to acknowledge it yet. So you have to be on top of this. All right, getting close, guys. Seven point nine miles. Let's see. Would this be a good screenshot? Probably not, but like just in case, we have it in there to use for a thumbnail. We'll see which one I pick. All right, uh, 125. Oh, yeah. I just remembered Alaskan trucks. This is really random, and I'm, like, so sorry. I'm drifting so off from my origins, just like Thousand Pound Sisters, which, by the way, totally, like, season four... Uh, which I, I was on like season four, episode 10, I think this is so random. Um, and it, like by that point, I'm just like, th this is nothing to do with the origins of this show. And it's, it's just drifted so far from like the original, like plot of weight loss and all that. But I mean, it, weight loss, obviously is the theme of the show. It was always in the background somewhere. Oh boy. All right. All right. Everyone calm down. All right. Um, Anyway, so what was drifting off from the plot? 
something was, and I don't remember what it was because it's it's getting late. Okay. Um. Oh my God, the emergency. Wait, is it shift? This is not what I needed right now. I'm actually gonna I'm I'm gonna cry, guys. This is so annoying. Holy. Sh Yeah, I don't know what in the world is going on today with the emergency break because I'm going to have to look into that at some point and, and try and uh, come to a realization on why that's happening. I, I don't think it's a bug because that wouldn't make sense and I've never seen that before. But at the same time, I don't think I'm pressing a key that's doing that. So I don't know what that's all about, but I'm just going to kind of shut up and hopefully it won't happen again in the next 3.8 miles. But we'll see. I wouldn't be shocked. This is a train sim world after all. But, you know, could I shouldn't say that, though, because it's very likely it's my error. But I don't know. This is going to be, uh, I'm going to feel pretty accomplished when we pull into the station. You best believe it. Yeah, th this was kind of a goofy video, I'm not going to lie. Uh, it's a late night, being a bit of a goof. Uh, all jokes aside, though, it's good to be back. And hopefully I will return relatively soon for the next episode and not kind of go off for a while. Uh, we'll see, though. I don't know. This depends. I've got various things going on I have to attend to. Uh... But I really appreciate you guys, all 42 of you. And if you're visiting here, uh, why not subscribe if you're willing to do such a thing? We have some fun. I try and have some fun. Uh, and and just, just, you know, sit back, relax, enjoy, enjoy some trains. And at some point, we're, we're going to... We're going to kind of branch off and do some other stuff, but I couldn't come back with something weird, you know? I'm just like, we got to go back to train some worlds. It would be weird if I was, uh, I don't know, driving a bus for the first video back. OMC 2 is like $20 right now, so I'm looking at that. That's a pretty good price. It's, no, it's not a good price. I shouldn't say that. That would be a very hypocritical thing for me to say with the stuff I complain about for this game, but... It is much cheaper than it usually is. Uh, and it's, I'll be honest with you, the game should be like $10 at this point. Okay, the physics and sounds are great on the... Whoops. The physics and sounds are... Oh, boy. Physics and sounds are great on the buses. However, the graphics are absolutely terrible. Um, oh, boy. Why are we slowing down that fast? What is going on? Did you see that? Did you see the speedometer? Oh, my gosh. This is this is crazy. There's, there's something wrong with this train. We must have hit like something got messed up while we were in maintenance or something. Oh my gosh, I I am about to, oh, <laughs> that's what the alerter's for, I was like, I'm about to pass out, but no, I can't, because I have to hit the alerter, so, you know what, that, whoever came up with that idea, good job, because that, I'm sure it does its job, okay, we're gonna go down to 30, because it's gonna take forever to get down there, <clears throat> so we're gonna do that right now. 5,000 feet, oh my gosh, I almost said miles, jeez, sign of the times, sign of the times, okay. Coming in here on Providence, track one, of course it's track one. What other track would it be? We're always number one. Yep, that's how we do things around here. <laughs> always number one, and then I disappear for four months, okay, okay. Um... Yeah, so happy late 4th of July once again to all of my American friends. I uh, hope you all celebrated somehow and enjoyed yourself. Didn't get your any limbs blown off by some sort of a firework or 
explosive device because I know I saw someone doing something crazy with like a big guy. Uh, it was literally just an explosion. There's no like fireworks or it was just a big bam. America, baby. But I hope this. Uh, what could you call it? I mean, could you call that like a the like a an American year, like July Fourth to July Fourth? Because like you know how there's like years for like different things, like that start different to like the I don't know, like the MLB season, right? Except like the American season, because July Fourth, July Fourth. Anyway, hopefully we'll really count on the value the values of uh, beer, barbecue, and freedom. Uh, okay. Stop, 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 stop. Come on, don't don't do this. We're good, we're good. Alright, uh I'm actually gonna run off and hopefully we don't crash. Alright, we're good. I just shut off the safety system so we don't um and I shut off the HUD apparently. Oh no, I'm sitting in the wrong seat. I was like, why does that look so weird? Alright, don't... Go full, full brick. Alright, we're, over, we're overshooting it a little bit, but it's all good. Well, jolly good show, everyone. Uh, that was fun, kind of, right? It was, it was a bit of a pain. This is, wish me luck editing. This is going to be a whole load of fun. Thank you guys for sticking with me, seriously. In all seriousness, thank you very much for being back with me here on slushy slug and i hope uh I, I will return soon and not in four months so thank you all for watching have a great day everybody